Bolaños entered the ring with the Mexican music in the background and somebody waving the Mexican flag and now you say Ray Boom Boom Bautista. This fight is at 119 pounds. Bautista, the WBO Asia Pacific Bantamweight Champion, rated number three in the world. He's undefeated with a record of 15 and 0, 11 coming by way of knockouts. He won the title on August 17, 2004 with a second round TKO over Sang Sak Singh Manasak. On October 24, he scored a first round TKO over Christian Casino. And on January 29, won a 10-round decision of Vuisile Bebe. Now, last March 11th in Honolulu, he won a fifth round TKO over Ari Posuwan Jim at the Blaisdell Center in Honolulu. He also trained for a short while in uh, in the wildcard gym of Freddie Roach. And Freddie Roach said, this boy is going to be a world champion. Now we're going to have the Philippine National Anthem. Upcoming sensation, Miss Jennifer Bautista of Viva Records. Jennifer Bautista. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, a warm big applause for Miss Jennifer Bautista. Yeah, that was a tremendous rendition of the Philippine National Anthem by Viva Recording Star and one of the great future superstars in the world of singing and entertainment, Jennifer Bautista, who I understand is related to Commissioner Bautista, I think the daughter, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> And, uh, you know, this jam-packed crowd, uh, Sandy, I mean, they're looking forward to a tremendous fight. Well, Gilberto Bolanos, Bolanos uh, Mexican hitman, he coming in to try 10 wins, 8 losses. And, of course, 10 by way of knockout, coming off a unanimous decision loss to highly rated Phil Am. Nonito Denari last November 12. And one of his biggest wins was a 7th round TKO over Roach. Uh, Price fighter and Manny Pacquiao's firing partner, 
Karen Harut Yunan on August 6, and that was last year. Well, during our introduction, I told you that uh, this uh, this this uh, Bautista, Ray Boom Boom Bautista, he is a good finisher and a strong puncher. Right, he is, and uh, you know, he also uh, battled undefeated Rudy Dominguez, I'm talking of Bolaños, who had drawn July 10 last year, so he's got the credentials. How well he's going to fare against Boom Boom Bautista, I do not know. Now, at this point, we'd like to thank our many fine sponsors. We'd like to thank our friends from Tandwai, the number one round. We've done a great job in supporting boxing. They would also like to thank uh, Smart PLDT in Talk and Text. And the other Viva Hot Babes that's, uh, that are being introduced, that's Zara Lopez. He mixed up the names, that's Zara. And Miles Fernandez is the other one. That's mine. That we will heat up our night here in Madawi. Miles Fernandez and Zara, Zara Lopez. Zara is the fairer one. And Viva Sports together with the Las Vegas Conventions and Visitors Bureau proudly presents to you first from the blue corner he weighed in at 190 pounds his professional record stands at 10 wins eight losses and one draw and all of his 10 wins are coming by way of knockout wearing green white red trunks he is the first mexican to fight fighter to grace the ring of cebu Ladies and gentlemen, from Ciudad Obregón de Mexico, Gilberto Bolaño! Again, for Bolaño from the fight fans here at the Mandawe Sports Center. And on my right, fighting out from the red corner, weighing at 180 pounds. He is undefeated of his 15th professional fight with 11 wins coming by way of knockout. He is rated number three in the World Boxing Organization Bantamweight Division. The bride of Gandhi Haibuhol and fighting out from the Allah stable of Cebu City. Ladies and gentlemen, the WBO Asia Pacific Champion, Ray Kufu Bautista. Ray Bautista, the big hand for the white fans here, preparing for a time for revenge. When the bell wins, the man in charge of fight is none other than the international referee and judge, Teddy Boy Alivio. And a ring side judge, judge, Teddy Boy, I leave you. We're going to reach the 10, 10 rounds. We're going to the scorecards of Ben Necesario, international judge Salvin Lagubay, and judge Edwin Marientos. Our ring side doctors, Dr. Jose Unabia and Dr. Armindo Seniza Jr. This is Kijon for 10 rounds of action. This fight brought to you by our major sponsor, Stantoi, the number one drum. Uh, I want you smart, to fight clean. Fight. And okay. Talk and clean fight. Okay. Motor okay. Good batteries. Luck. Okay. And uh, Viva Video, as well as uh, Sulpicio Lines and the Marriott Hotel, where Bolaño stayed. Once again, this is the main event of the evening. El Gran Combate, Sandy Ronimo with uh, Ronnie Nathaniels, Gilbert Bolaños versus Ray Boom Boom Bautista, world uh, rank number three, WBO, and he is currently the Asia Pacific Bantamweight uh, champion. This is the first round, scheduled for 12. 10. It's scheduled for 10. 10. It's a non-title non fight. Bolaños, 
in the Mexican colors, green, white, and red. And, uh, Bautista with the familiar Allah Jim Black trunks. Bautista a little cautious. They're both fighters sizing each other up yes. because both got knockout punches. Bautista has got 11 knockouts in 15 wins, and Bolaños has won 10 fights all by knockout. So this, this uh, tells you something about the punching power of both fighters. Bolaños goes in, connects with the run. Is Teddy Alivio. International referee, very fine uh, referee. Bolaños trying to back him off, covering up. Bautista stalking Bolaños. A little wary at the, at the moment. Both fighters sizing each other up because you know both fighters can hit and you, they don't want to take any chances. Right? Bautista throws it right, raises the face of Bolaños. Good left by Bolaños, side of the head of Bautista. Bolaños doubles up his punches, his left especially to the side of the body and side of the head. And he says his best punch is the right straight, so Bautista better watch out. Still no small punches being thrown by both fighters here. Bautista trying to go inside and... Throws a looping right hand. Bolaños with the right to the body, he tried to double up with the left. But he's uh, rather cautious, you know, this young kid, all the time he tries to go for a knockout from the very first spell, but today he knows he's fighting a tough from Mexico, and uh, he he's playing it very, very cautiously. Jabbing with the left. want them to get it on. Yes. They have to give them time to settle down. Get it down! One two combination by Bautista. Bolaños comes up. So far it's been an uneventful round in the sense that both fighters are just waiting for, for the right time, sizing each other up, see what they got. Ten seconds to go in the, in the first round. Bautista trying to get a little leg aggressive, throws a good right uppercut. Bolaños with a hard right inside the body. There goes the bell and the brown number one. It's a good round. We'll take a break and come back in a moment. Bell for round number two. Fight scheduled for ten. Bolaños in green, Bautista in black. Bautista getting a little more aggressive, Sandy. Yes. Uh, he's about to get back on his right hand and uh, Bolaños escaping it. Still both fighters trying to feel each other's power. Bautista stalking Bolaños, throws a right to the side of the head and a right uppercut by, by Bautista. A right by Bautista, Bolaños cut off and come back to the right of his own. Clubbing right hand by Bautista. Well, Bautista is hard with bigger guys like Bobby Paquel, the younger brother of Manny Paquel. Right. And in, in, uh, when he trained at the Freddy Roach gym, he sparred with Israel Vasquez, the IBF Super Bantamweight champion, clubbing right hand by Bautista. Bolaños trying to cover up. Bolaños backing off. Bautista is becoming the aggressor here in this round. Good to left to the side of the body by Bolaños. Bolaños, Bolaños is, is, is left is his, his deadly weapon, although he does have a right straight. Good left by Bautista. Bolaños, yeah. 
Well, just a very cautious well, shooter. Right there by Bolaño. Bautista comes back. Oh! Connects with a good hard combination there. Bautista. Both fighters very busy here in the second round. Good right by Bautista. That shook Bolaño very clearly. Got out of trouble quickly. Bautista doubling up his punches. He left to the side of the body and then to the side of the head. Good combination there by Bautista. Bolaños comes with a hard left to the side of the body. Don't underestimate this Mexican hitman. He's got power in his fists. Bolaños can't, uh, Bautista can't afford to get careless. Yes. Ten seconds remaining in round number two. There goes the bell end of round number two. We'll take a quick break and come back in a moment and see the Viva up waves as a round goes. Miles Hernandez, the Viva Hot Babe, doing a little shake <laughs> and bake. <laughs> Exciting the fight fans here at the Mandawe Sports Center. All week the town has been talking about the Viva Hot Babes. The sports writers have been writing about the Viva Hot Babes. And these guys are having one hell of a time. Fantastic crowd here. I mean, unbelievable crowd here. Even though we sports center. The bell for round number three. Bolaños in green, white and red, Mexican colors. And uh, Bautista in the back of the famed Allah gym. Bautista the aggressive. Right up under the good left. Bolaños taking the left and then connecting the right. Bautista walks through the body. They exchange a hard body shots there. Mix up. Yes. They certainly like to work with the body. Yes. But it's a wild with the left. This is round three, scheduled for ten. But it's a short, long looping right hand. It was a little short. Bulanio doesn't seem to be too worried. I mean, he's biding his time. Bautista has caught him with a couple of tough, hard shots, but the Mexican appears unfazed. Yeah, he seems to... He can't take the punches of uh, Boom Boom Bautista. Bautista trying to go in, trying to work to the body. Good hard left to the side of the body. And a clubbing right hand by Bautista. And left the body. Look at great Boom Boom Bautista. Very busy here. Bolaños backing off. The power of Boom Boom beginning to tell. And a hard right. right. But Bolaños, Bolaños. That's like Bolaños. Yes, but he's fighting back. And he is in trouble now. He is right on. The Bautista leans on him against the ropes. You can see the awesome power, the power of Boom Boom Bautista. Bautista. Bolaños in trouble there. Bolaños. Yes, you can see that in his face right now. Yes. Throws a right. And he left, but he gets nailed by Bautista. Bautista going after the Mexican. And he clubs him with the right hand. Bolaños trying to tie up Bautista at this stage of the fight. Throws an uppercut, misses. Bautista very composed in this round. I think he's winning this round. Oh, yes, definitely. No question about it. Bautista oh, working on the solid body. punches by a... Oh! Gets up. That was a right up. Big punch. Crowd is on his feet. They want Bautista to finish him off. Bautista is attacking right now. Bolaños is nailed with a hard right. He's trying to fight back. He's going back. He's tired again. Bautista. Oh, and he hit uh, Bolaños hit Bautista on the jaw. Good left by by Bolaños. Thundering right hand by Bautista. Look at the punching power of Bautista. Bolaños is fighting back. Yes. What a fight. That goes the bell, end of the round, what a great round! And the crowd reacting to that round. The crowd is on its feet. What a round, we'll take a break and come back in a moment. Sarah Lopez getting a big hand from the fans. 
one of the Viva hot babes who spiced up this night of boxing. And there you see some slow mo action. Look at that right up, that beautiful punch. Perfectly timed, and Bulanius goes down on one knee. Look to this corner, look for advice. He stayed down till the count of eight. This is round number four, scheduled for 10. And Ray Boom Boom Bautista against Gilberto Bolaños, the hitman from Mexico. But I al always say Bautista has got to be wary because this, this kid from Mexico can punch. Yes. And he's like any Mexican fighter, a warrior. Bautista with a solid left of the body. And, oh, a right uppercut. But Bolaños fighting back but getting nailed by Bautista. He can't do the good left. Bautista out punching. Bolaños down. Bolaños wild on the right. The fans getting their money's worth here. Which stinging, stinging punches by Bautista. Bolaños comes back with the body. Bautista with the right up. by Bolaños. Pushes Bautista back. Remember, this is a time for revenge. We want to erase the memory of the bitter defeat of Manny Pacquiao to Eric El Terrible Morales. And if there's one fighter that can erase that memory, it's Ray Boom Boom Bautista. Well, uh, we all know that he's going to be the future world champion. And after Teddy Alivio. Says there's a cut as a result of a punch that that doesn't seem to be like a major problem the ring physician taking a look at it well he can continue this yes this is still round number four scheduled for ten well, I just coming in trying to work to the body he was down back in the third round. Good combination there by Boom Boom Bautista and Bolan is trying to answer it back. All of Bolanius win. Uh, oh, the left. Dragging left. Bolanius in trouble again. But he's fighting back. He's standing yes. and slugging it out with Bautista. Bautista wild on the right. Make that left. You know, you can never underestimate a Mexican fight. That's true. They're warriors. They're courageous. And they'll fight to the death. Look at the Mexican gates, Eric El Terrible Morales, Marco Antonio Barrera, Juan Manuel Marquez, Rafael Marquez, Julio Cesar Chavez, a long list of good right by Bolaños is slowly coming back against Bautista. Bautista getting a little wild and missing some of the punches. Trying to go too hard for a knockout. Work to the body, then to the head. Uh, look at the blood. It's coming out. It's all over the face of uh, Bolaños. Oh. Oh. Seconds. Of round number four, there goes the bell. We'll take a break, another action pack round, and we'll come back in a moment. Miles Hernandez, the Viva Hot Bird, serving as a round girl for our spot. <laughs> come to I round, and she's getting it on. <laughs> she's doing her thing. Well, I'm running out of words. <laughs> come to I, the number one rum. The one that people drink it. We'd like to thank our friends from Tanduai Rao. Also like to say a special thank you for Mr. Danny Pangalina, Ricky Barber, Boy Martinez, our friend Ricky Isla from, from Smart, PLDP and Talking Text. Also, uh, Ms. Cheryl Uwana, Cebu City Marriott Hotel, Republic Chemicals Incorporated. This is round five. This has been an action-packed fight so far. That's right. Boom Boom Bautista certainly getting the better of the exchanges, but Bolaños uh, fighting back on occasions and still on his feet, that's for sure. A cracking left by Bautista. The 
only problem with Bautista is sometimes he gets a little too eager to go for an up. And he leaves his face wide open. Yeah, sometimes. And look at that. Thundering uppercut by Bautista. Uh, good right hand by Bautista. But Bolaños comes back with a clubbing right hand. Actually, this uh, Mexican prize fighter, he is still standing up. Yes. Taking the uh, punching power of Bautista. Went down in round number three. Remember, he's got ten wins, all ten by knockout, so he can punch. Bautista missed with an immaculate record of 15 and 0. Bautista wild on his right and left. Bolaños ties him up. Right hand by Bautista, right uppercut, and Bolaños in a little bit of trouble again, but he's fighting back. Bautista the aggressor, Bolaños ties him up. Bolaños misses with a wild right hand. Bautista going to the body. Seems a left to the body and then a right uppercut. Oh, Bolaños came back with the right, but Bautista nailed him too. And now Bolaños throwing a couple of big right hands and left. A good right hand there by Bautista. And a right uppercut. He's trying hard to put Bolaños away, but having a tough time. Good fight. Action back fight. Ray Boom Boom Bautista against. Gilberto Hitman Bolaños. Good left. Bolaños came back to the left of his own. Hitting Bautista there in the jaw. I think the body punching of Bautista will ultimately tell on Bolaños. Because he's working the body and working it well. Definitely after this fight he will he will feel the pain. Ten seconds remaining in this round. It's a good round. Another good round. Good combination of the bell. Take a break and come back in a moment. This is Viva Sports presentation of the main event before a jam-packed crowd here at the Mandawe Sports Complex. And what a night for boxing. The main event, Ray Boom Boom Bautista, a champion of the future against Mexican hitman Gilberto Bolaños. See the corner of Bautista there. Really now he's this has been an action pack fight so far. You see his record 15 wins, 11 coming by way of knock. That's the corner of Bolaños. Some slow more action in that previous round. Bolaños getting nailed to the body by Bautista. He's really working to the midsection. Well, uh, Bautista getting excited now. Oh, oh! Well, the Mexican didn't come man. out. Didn't come out. That will end the fight just like that. That was a rather surprising ending. That was a rather surprising ending. He was was he cut? I can't quite see it from here. Oh. But I think he, he was caught and then he decided to stick on the sit on the bench. And it was a good fight. It was a good fight while it lasted. Yes. So again, the boom boom Bautista winning against the Mexican hitman Gilberto Bolaños. So now uh, Bautista record goes up to 16 wins. 16 wins. That's his father. He's still a kid. He's an 18 year old kid. That's right. 16 wins, 12 knockouts, and there you see the uh, trainer of Bolaños uh, ripping off his gloves. That was a sayang. That was a, you know, unfortunate ending to what promised to be a really good fight. It was a good fight while it lasted. It was action-packed, but I think the punching power of Bautista ultimately proved a little too much for Gilberto Bolaños. Bautista knocked down uh, 
Bolaños back in the third round. Let's see this Lomo. There was a flash of heads there, and then the uppercut. That was a perfectly timed uppercut. Then a right to the side of the head, and Bolaños went down for the first and only time in the fight. But he was he was uh, in trouble several times during the fight, but he was fighting back when the end came, when he sat on his stool. Let's listen to the ring announcer. Boxer, Gilberto Polanios refused to continue the fight. And we have the winner by technical knockout at the start of the sixth round. Ladies and gentlemen, still undefeated, Ray Bungo Bautista! We have it, the, the ring announcer of El Manosa announcing the winner, Ray Bungo Bautista, 16 wins right now. Um, Gilberto Bolaños, the Mexican, refused to come out for the sixth round. He was seated on his stool, and there is his trainer raising the hand of, of Bautista. It was a good fight while it lasted. Ray Boom Boom Bautista waving to his fans who would have liked this fight to continue really and expected Bolaños to really come back and he was coming back slowly getting a couple of good punches of his own but ultimately Ray Boom Bautista took a little too much for him. A round of applause for Gilberto Bolaños. That's Ray Boom Boom Bautista. And we will take a break and come back in a moment.